started playing basketball in early first grade. Not just because my size, just because I was taller than everybody. It just felt like I could be authentic to who I am. Good, pop your feet. That's it. Being able to know that my game transfers well to the next level. This isn't a time to mess around. This isn't a time to take your foot off the gas. There's a lot of other people trying to steal your spot. This is where the best of the best come. This is where you find out who you really could be. Begin to visualize yourself, your performance, how you want to play, how you want to look, how you want to start off the day. Visualize it, see it. My mama told me. I'm from Philadelphia, PA, and I've lived all over PA. My childhood has uh, been a bumpy road. We've been able to live in a lot of different locations. Yes, sir, let's get it. John, break us out, Big J. But me and my mom and my family have just always used to just living on the road. Two, three, family, four, five, six, be great. One, two, three. Family. Four, five, six. Be great. Let's jog get it. it out, jog it out. Let's go, boys. Six, six, six. My mom played basketball and my mom's father played basketball. Two, one, two. Yes, sir. She scored 1,000 points at Penn State. She's grabbed over 700 rebounds. Driving baseline. Step away, Derek. Finish. Up. Good. She's the reason why I play basketball. She's the reason why I'm doing all this, so that I can give her the best life possible. So being able to play basketball, and I ended up finding myself at West Town. Sophomore year is whenever I finally stepped onto the court as a high school player, and that's when I started to find myself making a name for myself. Man, I'm on fire. I light the whole city up. Pull up in the dump truck. Oh, Looking like right a serious. Riding oh, like the president. That's it, Derek. We just came to I got my first offer my sophomore year summer. That's what we're here for every day, man. That was always something I've always wanted. Just being able to say I have a college D1 offer is something I've always dreamed of. Yep. step through. Ha, ah, good. Freshman year to my senior year, I went from a jump from being an unranked nobody to my senior year being the number one player in the class. You ain't ready for it till you there. You gotta work every day till you get ready. Being able to go to Duke knowing that I have a target on my back. That's just the environment that I just love being in. This moment is just where you build, you build on yourself, challenge yourself, you break yourself down until you wanna quit and you keep going. I just really look forward to the competitive edge, being able to play against the best of the best, being able to play against the pros. It just comes with a certain level of respect. Here we go. Sit, sit, yep, yep, yep. Good job, Derek. Because the real work really starts. Yep. You can always dream about it, but the dreams is never gonna live up to reality whenever you get your name called. Take off, take off. Take off, get your feet set, right, boom. I've always thought about it, I've always had dreams at night about it, but there's nothing that's gonna live up to the real moment. I'm Derek Lively II, and this is my road to the draft.